Hello, everybody. Just you here. How much time do I got? Unlimited. Okay. Um, I know I have not been. Damn light. Oh, can't move you that far. Let me see if I can move over. But um, I know I haven't been on for a while. I said I was. I had plans to record so and so and such and such. But all I've been doing all week is really cleaning my house. And as you see behind me, there is some stuff. We are going to be painting my bedroom. Okay. That's what we're going to be doing. We're going to be painting my bedroom uh, this weekend. So, yeah. So, anyways. Um, I do want to show you that damn light. Don't bother. That's not light from my door. I'm trying to block as best I can. Um, today, I am doing what I wore this month. I was supposed to do it Tuesday. I know it's Wednesday, Thursday. I am so sorry. But we're, I need to get these polishes put back on the rack. I need to put shit away, you know. Okay, let's start with the one polish that I have. Hold on, I gotta get magnifier. Okay, um, so yeah. I am showing what I wore this month because this stuff has to go on. Um, my nail polish racks and everything, I'm just like moving over so it's light them and get in the way. Okay, good, so as long as I don't go this way. But it looks like I'm all on the side here, so I'll just show everything over here. Okay. Um, I'm going to show you something very special last that I wore this month. Okay, let's start with um, the first one I wore. I got this from... Sorry, I have hair in my nose. Um, Vicky Burge. I really love this brand. I do... I am going to go back and get more. Um, but it might be, like, very slowly. But this is the brand, if I can turn it. Um... Heck. Morton Taylor. And there's a swatch for it. That's the swatch right here. I'm gonna try some. Hold on. Give me one second. I'm gonna bring you guys forward. Right here. I'm trying to put a little light in here. Hold on. Oh, that doesn't help. There, let's see if that works. Alright, there. That's Morgan Taylor. And this was two one to two coats. This is a very good formula. Okay, the next one. Oh, you know what I'm holding my polishes in? I want to show you. This little box I got from um, Tracy. I love this box. They had the um, giraffe on it. So, that's what I'm using for... My polishes. That's what I might use this box for. All right, I gotta take out my polishes here. So, how's everybody's week going? You know, my week's going okay. Some of you know what's really, really going on. Okay, this one here, I got this one from my friend Leanne. I always talk to her every day on Snapchat. She's a sweetheart. I really, this girl. I really, really. If I'm squinting, it's the light that's coming in from the window. Um, she's a really good sweetheart. Her and I talk about everything. I practically tell her everything. She tells me everything. But, yeah, she's a sweetheart. Okay, this one is called Midnight Blue. This is from Sinful Colors. And this has a very beautiful blue sheen to it. I wore this for fourth, um, Memorial Day weekend. So beautiful. And I put on top of it... Where is it? I put on top of it uh, finger paint stars and stripes forever. This thing it is kind of hard to. That's the glitter right there. I don't know if you can see it. Here, turn it this way. You can see how the glitter is. It's like going down, but it's okay as long as you shake it up. So I can get shook up. Oh, I show you as best I could. I can put on my shaker, but this is what I wore on top of it. It's very pretty. I mean, you can get some stars out, but I like to have, like, all three of the colors, you know. Okay. Let's see. The next one I wore was Glow Stick. Um, no, that's not it. Where is it? I'm getting, trying to get the swatch here. Okay, Glow Stick. I, what I use for Glow Stick for the white is, um, is white on white. I didn't grab that bottle because of, um, 
white on white everybody basically knows i have it knows about it i don't need to grab the bottle the swatch or anything plus i can't find it it's around here somewhere i just gotta look for it my all my my polishes are all messed up because i switched uh shelves with my son kind of missing my old shelf because the one i have had if you guys remember was the cube one damn light the cube one so um yeah the cube one so it's I, that's what he has. The one I have just has regular shelves, like a bookshelf. So, but anyways, this is Glow Stick. I love this one. I, this is the very first polish I put on when I got my nails done. Last month. Okay, let's see. Let's grab the next one here. This is Gobs, Gobs Smackin' Good. This one here, I... I'm so honestly glad I have two more of these. This is the Butter London. I won't go out and purchase these unless they're on sale. This is the Butter London um, bottle. And it is called God Smackin' Good. I don't know if you can see that shimmer. This was like three coats. And no, I did not use, for Vicky to know, I did not use... Um, the peel off base coat I want to make that as a video but I wanted to wear this so bad so I couldn't do it and I will still won't have time this week to do it okay the next one is okay this one has no name on it so it's the wet and wild uh, wild shine I bought this in like the collection they had with the lipstick and the uh, the nail polish it is I named it C468 and that's what's on top of the bottle I don't know if that's backwards but that's what it looks like but this is what it looks like this was two coats to be fully opaque if I can pick up the bottle this is very beautiful I love it I mean it's a silver yes I know I got many other silvers but hell what do you expect okay oops I put that one back in there why did I just do that where'd it go oh here it is Okay, everybody knows this color. I'm not making anybody. I don't really remember wearing this, but, yeah. I really don't remember wearing this this month. But, of course, it's Coca-Cola Red, and you guys know about my Coca-Cola Red. That's it right there. If I can show you with the stick frontwards. Two, one to two coats be fully opaque. I love this. I have two more bottles backing up them because I love them. Okay, the next one. Be my, okay. This one here, I really love this. I want to go back and get more if I can grab the bottle. What's my problem today? Um, this is the Nail Teak Ink. Not Teak, Ink. Nail Ink, and this is called... B Berman hold on. Let me grab the cause with well, the swatch sticks you can't I can't get all the names on it. Bermansty Street. I don't know if you guys can see that. Of course. I don't know if you can see that. But Berman's D Street, if I say it right. And the, um, I guess from this collection, because I don't know where this collection is from, the top of the bottle, the lid, feels like what the nail polish is supposed to feel like. And I wore this without no top coat. And actually, it lasted a very pretty amount of time, because I think I wore this for like a week. Because I didn't, that's when I was depressed. I didn't do my nails, and it didn't chip. I can't remember when it chipped. I wasn't really paying attention. I just got tired. I wanted to get my nails done. But I really love this brand. Really love this brand. I want to go get more. Okay, the next one is... I was in the mood for like a white. But I didn't want a pure white. Like white and white. I wanted something with a little bit of kick into it. So, of course, I have Coca... Uh, Coca-Cola Red. I have Coconut by Hard Candy. But I don't... This is not the normal... I don't know what it is. It's not the normal one. But I really do love this. If I could show you with the front of the stick. I really love this color because the fact that it has a, uh, a like little shine to it. I don't think you're going to be able to see it here. A little shine to it, but this is so pretty. This is three coats, but it's well worth it. I love this white. 
Okay, the next one is what I think about blue. Oh my God, this one here. I put this thing on my nails. Okay, I'm gonna tell you guys. I put this thing on my nails and this thing, this polish, Sorry, I'm wearing my, one of my husband's Dago tees. Keeps me cool at night. But this polish, you put this on your nails. Oh my God, guys. Letting you know right now, the shine on this bottle bumps up. It like shows sunlight, uh, home at your house light. This thing is gorgeous. I mean, I don't know if you can see it here, but this, look at this baby. I don't know if it's me or my camera's messed up. But this thing is gorgeous. I highly recommend you get this from the Light Bright. Yeah, the Light Bright collection. They still have them on Head to Toe Beauty, so let everybody know. They're all fully stocked on Head to Toe Beauty. I love Head to Toe Beauty. I ordered this month, I ordered from Head to Toe Beauty, um, what is it? A nail polish rack. Don't ever order a nail polish rack from Head to Toe Beauty if you do not want to pay $40. That's the only complaint I got about it. it the, the, con, the pros of it is that it came packaged very nicely. It, um, it was sturdy. It was clean. Um, I know I snapped a few of you about it, but, you know, if you guys ever want to chat, Snapchat. Snapchat. I'm really into Snapchat. I talked to Leanne on there. I talked to Tracy on there. Um... But me and Leanne talk, like, practically since we get up in the morning to all night, you know? Until, like, 2, 3 o'clock in the morning. We talk every day. And it's about the dumbest shit. But she's just a sweetheart. And Tracy, I want to talk to you more. You need to get on there. <laughs> but any of you who want to talk, you know, I'm bored during the day. And it keeps me occupied. Like, you know, I'm, stay at, I'm a stay-at-home mom. I'm home all the time because, you know, most of you know I can't drive. So it's like... I might as well. I got my Snapchats. I feel like I have a friend with me. Not in person, but just right there where I just snap with them, you know? That's how I feel. Okay, this next one. I wanted to wear this, and this, I think, was three coats? This was some more fun. I really do love this. This thing is nice. I forgot what collection this is from. Just look it up, please. I completely forgot. I would say I would put it right here, but still can't do it yet. But next month... My computer will be ready, and there will be edited videos, and my eye will be ready to go. So, this is some more fun. Okay, we got two more polishes. This next one is called, I Got a Blue Attitude. This thing is beautiful. I really do love this. Um, this is very pretty. This was too cold to be fully opaque. I mean, look at this baby. I mean, it is gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Last one, and that, um, that one was from the Light Bright Collection. This next one's also from the Light Bright Collection. Whip It Good. Some of these, like, I don't know if you guys, it, it, all of you people that were in the 90s and that grew up in the 90s um, or had kids that grew up in the 90s, let's put it like that. All these, like, some of these I've, like, Whip It Good is from, I think, a song that was either from the 90s or 80s. But, like, some of these sayings they have on these bottles, my God, I, it reminds me of, like, the 90s for some odd reason. I don't know why. I don't know if it's just me. Like, Papa Don't Preach. I think that's part of the 90s. I gotta look that up. I'm not really sure. These might be from 80s. But still, my God, I wish China Glaze would come out of collection. China Glaze, if you are watching my video, um, I wish they would because I would love to be affiliated with China Glaze. But, um, or if anybody knows this, China Glaze should come out with a 90s collection. I think they should because I would love to have a 90s collection. There was a, um, Glitter Days came out with a 90s collection. I wanted that whole entire collection like crazy. And all be, the colors were gorgeous, but because of the names and because I miss the 90s. I want to go back to the 90s. I love the 90s. I wasn't born in the 90s. I grew up in the 90s, so I'm a 90s kid. But um, I love the 90s. I would love to go back. The music, the... The clothing, the shoes, because the shit that you can't find now, I'm very picky with clothes and shoes. The stuff you can't find nowadays that are, that my style is, it's so hard to find. It is. I want to buy me a pair of shoes off of that, um, it's either called, oh, what the heck's it called? There's two websites. 
the heck are these guys doing out here? I'm sorry, I get to see right next across the street. Um, what's the name of them? Shoe Dazzle, and um, there's another Shoe Dazzle, and I can't think of the next one. Shoe Dazzle is something else. I can't think of it. I'll try to rack my brain. But um, this last one is called Whip It Good. This was like a two to three coater, but it's beautiful. Look at that polish. And I bet you $500 I got all bunch of polishes that look the same like this. Maybe I should do a dupe video of polishes that look what they look like in my eyes. Maybe that might be interesting for everybody because uh, Tracy, my friend Tracy, she said, like, why don't you do a dupes video? Which I keep thinking a dupes video is like, you know, it's going to be kind of hard for me because of the fact that I'm not able, oh no, we got one more. I'm not able to figure out what's a dupes, but you know, maybe look interesting if I do a dupes video in my eyes. So maybe that's how I shall call it that. So everybody, because everybody, if you guys all been on my channel there for a while, you guys will see, notice I'm colorblind and I have hard time telling color. And I think it might be interesting for all you people out there to see what I see through my eyes with these colors and polishes and stuff, you know? Okay, the last box, and I was actually, I was wanting this so bad. When uh, OPI came out with the, the Alice Through the Looking Glass, I had to think, look on here because the name's on here. They had a special edition polish. So me, I went to Ulta at the beginning of this month and I saw it there. I said, uh-uh, I'm buying this. I was going to either order it or buy it. So I bought it, which I should have ordered if I had been cheaper. I don't care at this point. I don't care. But that's what it looks like. Um, I don't know if my Ulta has any more. If your Ulta does, I recommend to go out and get it. I wore this thing, and I love this. Okay, I'm going to tell you about this. You know how there's bar glitters in this, right? And it's a gray. Go figure out where people say it, but it looks like a gray to me, so I'm going with gray. Um, people were saying that the bar, there's bar glitters in here, which there is, because you can honestly tell there's bar glitters in here. But they are not, like, sticking up bad if you, but you do need a good top coat um you guys I use my HK girl so this one is very very beautiful but I love this I wore this the last time before I got my nails done for this month but this is I mean look at this I, don't see it. I mean it is beautiful so this one here I do recommend it Oops. I do recommend this this is well worth it I swear well worth it so but I keep it in the box because honestly this is my very first and probably only limited edition polish I got lucky that day when I went to Ulta um if you guys Ulta's like mine do not shop for makeup because I took back a, a blush that was $22 which I should have kept it but I didn't I felt it and I didn't like the cream I don't like cream blushes I like the powder it's like powder good cream come on but so I returned that um, I returned two other things it was the eyeliner like the like the cream eyeliner it was like in a, a, pa a palette um, the other one was a color corrector so I returned that. I don't use color correcting. I use my CoverGirl, which I'm going to be changing foundations hopefully next month. I got to see what I'm going to order, though, and what I'm going to buy and stuff like that. And plus, my son's birthday is next month. So be ready for a lot of uh, birthday hauls for my son. You guys know I do those. So be ready for them, okay? There's going to be a lot of birthday hauls. My husband picks up. I pick up. There's going to be a lot, okay? So be ready for those next month. Um... Tomorrow, if I have time, I'm going to try to put up a video. Maybe I'll make a video tonight. That way, I can just put it up tomorrow. Maybe that's what I'll do. But the video I do want to make, was what I promised you guys, is the swatches of that I got from um, ones that I bought and uh, Vicky Burge. That's the ones I, I want to, um, you know, show you the swatch of. But I'm not going to include this in there because the fact that this one is already has a swatch on it. I've already showed you it, so don't consider this one. But trust me, I got more of um, him. So, okay, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm gonna let you guys go. Sorry again that I've not been on 
next week if things go right um i will be trying to put videos up every day of the week just bear with me i will be back in my in my routine i miss my routine so and plus i gotta really fix up um my polishes i might be doing a polish um polish organization or organization or organization a where i store my polish there we go easier i'm gonna probably do that next month if you guys are interested you know let me know but um and i'll show you guys my room when it's done i'll also show you guys that so i hope you guys have a good rest of your week i'll see you guys hopefully tomorrow if not i might make another video i can't i might make another video to put up i don't know but let's just end this one and get this one up there okay i'll see you guys later bye